Tuesday the 29th of November Six degrees centigrade, rather chilly there Very misty Works vans everywhere. It's, very, it's starting to look very much like winter now. Well, it is winter, isn't it? It is winter. It's definitely up on us now. So, we're obviously on the promenade there, the Manchester pub dead ahead. It's the uh, Craigie Don Hotel on our left hand side, heading south, Balmoral Hotel and the Royal Sea Bank. All of these hotels dead opposite the water treatment centre. Okay. Carry on down the prom. As you can see, it's a very, very bleak winter's day today. I gotta say the weekends are good the weekends have been good up to now since the end of the season the Christmas by the sea has definitely definitely made an impact uh, this year it's, uh, it's a lot better than it has been in previous years so you know get yourself down here and check it out before before Christmas is here it's uh, it's well worth a visit now on the weekends that's if you that's if there's no bloody train strike of course that's the uh, that's the madness of it. You know, we do these things, try to draw people to the town, and then uh, lo and behold, the unions give us a re the train strikes. And because everywhere else the seasons are finished, where do they hit? They hit us. They hit us hard. That you can't see the top of the big one. Quite funny, actually. The mist. Robina Casino, um, the Sandcastle Water Park. White Tower Restaurant. I actually have never ever tried that that restaurant. I'll have to give that a give that a, a try one night. Quite odd. It's been there a long, long time and I've never tried it. For what reason I don't know. Just overlooked it. But then again I've not heard any reviews on it either. So if anybody any views have tried it in there, just uh, put the comments below. Because it's uh, I've never tried it. Never tried it. No, there's the drop of the big one. Oh, it's just appeared out of the mist. The new Esplanade Hotel. Stable Hotel. Hello, rooms. I'm sure, that was called just rooms before. It was called Just Rooms, not long ago. They change the names on these hotels, don't they? This uh, Hampton by Hilton, this is going to be massive when it's finished. They've actually doubled the size of it. It's huge. Okay, I have 
I'll tell you what, I'm going to, I'm going to come off the promenade here, I'm going to swing a, swing a left here. I'm going to take you up over uh, Arrowside Bridge and onto Highfield Road. Highfield Road's quite up and coming. There's a few nice little uh, trendy bars and what have you that have appeared. Yeah, so we'll just uh, swing a right onto Harrowside up over the bridge and run you down Highfield Road to just show you a few of the uh, little trendy bars that have just appeared uh, recently over the last couple of years. It all started off with um, a bar there called Winston's was one of the first ones, these little micro bars. He was the first one in, in there and uh, obviously people as they do, have seen these places taking off and taking money and like they do in Blackpool all the time, it's copy 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 time someone someone comes up with a good idea before you know it, you ain't got it on your own So this one dead ahead on the corner, this Italio, it says restaurant and cocktail bar. Before, it was just a restaurant, but they've obviously seen how well these little bars are doing. <laughs> so their, their new sign now reads restaurant and cocktail bar. I've not been, I was in it as a restaurant, it was very nice to be on, to be fair. But now it's called a restaurant and cocktail bar, so they can just go in there for drinks I would imagine. I'm just going to swing right here to show you one that's just appeared here just off Highfield Road, that Latio, which is a very nice one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to double back on myself here. Okay, right. On my right hand side here, just past this Italian restaurant, they've got one, a small micro bar called Latio which is very very nice I believe I've not been in it put your comments below if you have cocktails food gin and wine that's what the sign says so you got that one this one I mentioned before restaurant and cocktail bar Italio and three doors one two three four doors down from that as I turn here there's a one called I think it's called Marvin's which has just appeared very very recently I'll swing in here so you got the Italio there cocktail bar restaurant you got Marvin there you go card centre Marvin's just behind that bus Marvin's so that's two two years ago I think there was one bar so that's two coming up here now one there called Topo. That's three. You got Winston's. That's four. Number 30. That's five. <laughs> oh. So you got five. You got five bars and grills there. Restaurants. Cocktail bars. Whatever you want to say. It's really, really coming to life. I feel road actually. It's a uh, it's like the in place to be, you know, back in the back in the 80s you'd be saying it's where the yuppies are. You know? well, that's it, you got these all these little micro bars that are popping up everywhere. And uh, yeah, it seems they seem to be popular, but they I can understand why they're popular. Because you know, if you go into a big bar and there's only two or three people sat there, there's not much atmosphere, is it? But if you go into a small little bar and there's only two or three people, it's already got atmosphere. That's the way I look at it, you know. Always, you know, sometimes less is more in situations like that less is more anyway there you go that's a, a brief little run of Ifrio Road. road uh, if anyone's tried them bars I'm, the only one I've been in on there to be fair is Winston's and I must admit I enjoyed that but that's doubled in size since I was last in it uh, yeah I'll leave your comments below if you've you know if you've been in them bars or tried any of bars on the uh, Ifrio road up and coming 
at least it's uh, bringing life to the area instead of a load of old charity shops. That's all I've got to say. It's a good idea. Anyway, it's not your boy Leroy. I'm signing off now. I'm getting out of here. Catch you later. I'm going home for a bite to eat. Bye-bye.